Prime Minister James Marape has officially welcomed Vincent Fein, Member of Parliament Rainbow Paita, as the opposition's nominee for the role of Prime Minister in the upcoming vote of no confidence, scheduled for Thursday, September 12, 2024. He made the statement on Wednesday after Speaker Honorable Job Pomat and Clegg Kalaofa confirmed that the sixth vote of no confidence motion submitted by the opposition met all necessary requirements as confirmed by the Private Business Committee. Member of Parliament Renbo Paita has been nominated as the challenger. Prime Minister James Marape stated, I offer my congratulations on Paita becoming the opposition's nominee and appreciate the opposition for getting the forms filled in correctly as required by Section 145 of our Constitution and Section 130 of the standing orders. Prime Minister James Marape further stated, On Thursday morning, the name will be placed on Parliament notice and by operation of law, Parliament will adjourn to next Thursday when the motion is voted upon. Prime Minister James Marape further stated, Prime Ministership is not my birthright. It belongs to our people. In a parliament of equals, member of parliament will decide who is the best to serve in that office. I'm here by operation of section 63, invitation of the organic law on integrity of political parties and candidates to form government because Pangu Party, under my watch, returned 39 candidates after the 2022 national general elections. However, the constitution allows for vote of no confidence after 18 months. And since February this year, our nation has been impeded by those who want to lead or form government. It's good that we now address the vote of no confidence so the country, investors, and development partners can have clarity on national leadership. Prime Minister James Marape further stated, I have had the privilege of serving as the chief servant of Papua New Guinea for five years now. It has never been an easy task, but I don't blame anyone. I take full responsibility as the person at the top of the chain of command. If I remain Prime Minister next week Thursday, we will continue the restorations and reconstructions we have pursued since May 30th in 2019. He further stated, this constitutional process will allow Member of Parliament to decide where Renbo Paita can address the challenges our country faces now and into the future more effectively than I can. He further stated, I ask the people of all backgrounds in our country to remain united as leaders consider who will best guide us into our 50th anniversary next year and beyond. Politics is temporary, but our aim must always be a better country. I once again commend Rainbow Paita. He is talented, and I pray that God's will for our country prevails. Quoting from the Bible, Prime Minister James Marape added, In Daniel chapter 2 verse 21 and 22 says, God appoints and dethrones. May God's will for our country prevail always. Prime Minister James Marape further stated, To all my supporters, family, and Pangu followers, let us not take personal offense. Leaders are bound by the dictates of our country's constitution and God-given freedom of choice to decide for themselves. So I ask you all to respect Rainbow Paita and the opposition. A strong opposition is good for our democracy. Forget that even when he was trying to uh, lobby to become Prime Minister, he never produced a document. Yeah. Uh, so this is a bonus to the uh, opposition team that we should be proud of ourselves. <laughs>